y'all I just seen I seen a sad some sad shit. Listen, y'all, what's good? This is Courtney, and we finna talk about this show on Netflix called Black Spot. I'm on episode two. I want to say this is like a first look kind of thing. You know what my initial reactions to the the show so far. Now it's probably a, a net, yeah, it's a Netflix original, and the second season is coming out on the fourteenth. Now, I don't know what's been going on, but I love it that these uh, European TV shows, they come out, they, they listen, they, they better than our American ones in a lot of cases, especially when, when the whole theme is circulated around a isolated town. You know what I'm saying? Or a village, if you will. So, because this one, I think this one, yeah, it's a French one. And it's circulating around this logging town. And something about the woods. The woods around there is driving motherfucking going caca. And, um, being that. I would like to say, I'm going to say like homeboy off of Pet Cemetery, the soil is poor, because everybody right, that motherfucker ain't, ain't wrapped up too tight, to be, to be honest. You know what I'm saying? So, the thing about this town, Villa French, I'm going to fuck up this town's name, y'all, forgive me. It is basically a blank spot, a blind spot black spot no kind of signals no nothing cell phones don't work but i got something to say about this shit because uh, cell phones microwaves act all finicky and woo -to -woo, woo -to woo and all that internet the way they talking about like the internet don't work or whatever but the thing with that town is with it being isolated it has six times the more murders than the, what they saying that any motherfucking town in that country. I'm like, for real? I guess due to it being a blind spot. And ain't no telling what's blocking the signals or whatever. But, okay, so this new prosecutor comes because something happened to the last one. I don't know. They got rid of the last one. He showed up. I ain't gonna lie about him. His mannerisms remind me of Monk. You remember the show called Monk? Now, this dude, he kind of looks like him, too. Uh, this dude, the new prosecutor, he got all kind of allergies. That motherfucker allergic to everything. I'm like, bruh, you are in the freaking fracking woods, motherfucker. With all kind of pilot, different type of flora and everything. Dude, you need to be walking around with a hazmat suit on in this case. But he comes in. He got a, he's in the trunk of his car. He got stacks on stacks on stacks of unsolved murder cases. He's like, what the hell is going on here? And so we meet the captain of the police, uh, police unit, whatever. Ch a chick named what? Lorianne? Lorian? And she. Something about the woods with her. When she was young, she got kidnapped for three days. And the only way she was able to get loose, she was chained. One of her arms was chained to, uh, chained to somewhere. It looked like she was in a cave or some shit like that. She had to cut off her two fingers this finger and that finger. She had to cut them fingers off to get loose, right? So, girl, don't you kill that wolf. Don't you kill that wolf, because that wolf trying to show you something, girl. Okay, y'all, yeah, it's playing in the background, y'all. See, see that baby? That baby's scared, trying to show you something. But anyway, so, she basically said that what happened to her, talking about her wild boy at her fingers, but that wasn't it. 
So she got history with the mayor, the new mayor of the town. They had got some long, so teenage love for shit that happened way back in the day. Uh, he lost his daughter. His daughter done got kidnapped. So there's all kind of mess going on, you heard me? And, um, and it's just crazy. It's something about the woods in that town. Now, here's my thing. Now, the way the trailer was side up, I'm thinking we're going to get a little bit of Twin Peaks type of action. Twin Peaks is my shit. I'm always down for some twin a town doing that Twin Peaks shit, right? But actually doing it good and actually being original with the shit. So, she, when she basically said that, you know, they signals, basically the only thing they watch that public, what's their, like, landlines, and now that shit, cell phones don't work. Woo, woo, woo. Tell me why I see these motherfuckers on cell phones. And I'm just looking. Now, bitch, didn't you say y'all cell reception ain't work for damn? How's y'all cell phone? Then, then, like, her daughter, her daughter gonna be some kind of activist or whatever. Her daughter uh, got a motherfucking laptop on, got a wireless printer, everything. I'm like. What? How is y'all using this? What? 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 Hold up. I could have sworn y'all said, uh, y'all, uh, uh, motherfucking. Y'all signal ain't nothing in a blind spot. So it's them discrepancies that I. I it, it stops me. And I'll be like. Now, if you'd have worded it like, yeah, it's a blind spot and everything, I guess due to all the trees around them or whatever, but if you use a special type of uh, antenna, you gooch it, then, okay, yeah, I get it, I get it, okay, yeah, all right, cool, bet, you know what I'm saying, but... You know, that would, that would kind of stop me, pause me right there. But, now, what I'm watching is dub. It's English dub. Now, what I normally do when I'm watching uh, foreign TV shows, even movies, I keep the same damn audio. And I'm like, listen, just give me... Just, I read the subtitles. I will read the subtitles. But... This one is different. The uh, uh, the dub is good, so I I allow it. I will allow it. Now, uh, let me see. If this show do follow up with what I think is going to dealing with some some kind of strange shit happening to the in the forest. So supernatural mess or whatever. Then I'm going to be ice bone cool. I'm going to be so happy. Because then it will fall along the lines of my fa- one of my favorite TV series off of Netflix called Dark. Dark is everything. But Dark is going to be on another video. I'm going to do Dark later. Probably going to do Dark when I... Uh, yeah, I'm going to do Dark after I get through this. But... The vein is moody, it's dark. I'm talking about, you know, black spot and all that stuff. And I'm liking it. I just want them, just give me, if y'all saying some weird shit is going on. And the way the trailer was sat up, they like some supernatural mess. Then please, pretty please, pretty please, please, please deliver. Please, at the end of the last episode, it all falls and basically said that some wonky, some primordial ass elder god or something going on, some dimensional dweller. Oh, you know, anything. Just give me the payoff. That's all I ask. I'm going to tell you another. Let me tell you one show. Let me find it. I'm on. Let me find it. That, that boy, when that show, when, I, when we got to the end of that. I was so damn disappointed. Cause it built it up marvelously. But 
I did I didn't get my damn I ain't get my uh I ain't get my payoff like I wanted to man now I can't find it now okay so now I can't find it is it gone off of here I can't think of the name of it hold up wait a minute is that it y'all gotta forgive me okay let me tell you about this show the show i'm looking for okay so this show again in a village surrounded by woods and i think what i love about what about uh like european and basically yeah you know european shows or anything across the pond or whatever they really use their landscape they whole landscape is basically a character in the motherfucking show especially when it deals like with villages and uh and you know uh things with woods i love the things with woods because there's always something going on in them damn woods but i can't find it they might have took it off but that show i thought it basically that show had to deal with uh sex trafficking i'm thinking sex trafficking and a crazy serial killer and they had a teacher there she this teacher she was raised by wolves and i'm thinking okay whole raised by wolves is she a werewolf and this was going on because the way it was going i thought it was some supernatural shit going on but it didn't happen that wasn't it but despite it not being what i wanted it was still a good damn show but i feel so kind of way i feel like y'all misled me into thinking it was a supernatural mess but i digress but listen y'all black spot on netflix i'm digging it i'm digging it so um I'm, I'm, that's what i'm watching today see what's gonna happen and when i get through with it i'll do a a recap over the season and see what's what and let that be what it is and also what the hell is that that's somebody with horns so that wolf is your pet child listen don't hug with me I hope they don't hug with me. And I'm thinking I'm getting ready to see some supernatural shit. And it don't happen. But I got a strange feeling y'all gonna do me dirty. But, anywho. Black Spot. It's good. It's good. It's good so far. We'll see how the real high, high ends. Because I want to see how they're gonna do with the second season. Alright. Bye.